Hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf here, one only, and welcome to Destiny or Fate. So I found this game on Steam, and it's basically like a card roguelike deck builder, but you have like a whole team going in. The game is also made by the developer Blaster and under the publisher GameNet. And it also costs this much, and it's been officially released since like September. There hasn't been any other updates from there, and they don't have a Steam Workshop. So, just letting you guys know. So let's get into the game itself. With all this epic music going on in the background that you've been hearing. <laughs> so I've been wanting to try this out for a while now. So there's a lot of characters to unlock here. Okay, so we have Joanna, Kyle, and... Belfany? I don't know, I kind of like her little doggo over here growling at me. But we're going to try Kyle. So these are all his cards, okay? Get us... Oh, wait. I guess this is locked. I mean, I wouldn't be surprised, it does true damage. But there are difficulty ratings, too. So these are all your starting cards. You got defense, you got damage, you got poison. I always like doing poison builds. So yeah, we're gonna go with Kyle. Like always, if you guys enjoy the video, leave a like or dislike, whichever one. Doesn't matter to me. <laughs> oh, it also has a story too. By the way, I turned down the music for myself, and yet it's still blasting pretty loud. So, why does this guy just remind me of a Heartless? With just a bunch of Heartless in his hand. <laughs> oh my god, it's a Heartless in disguise. I knew it! <laughs> Do I want to play or skip tutorial? Um, I guess we'll play tutorial. Just a little bit. Oh god, sound effects are loud. Can I get to the uh, settings here? Jesus Christ. I feel like my ears have just been comboed to hell. I might have to turn this down to a 10. At least, or something. I guess Twitty's fine. Jeez. Oh, what was just going on there? Okay, so we just selected. We don't drag. Oh, the whole combo thing. Uh, there's another game that does this. Um, Neoverse. If you guys have ever seen Neoverse, they now do this. So let's go ahead. No, I'm supposed to use... Okay, sure. Okay, so I have one more orb I can do. Next turn is the enemy move. He would do 15 damage to me. So I should guard. Okay, so it's whichever one it's actually on is what I use. I thought I was supposed to use the attack decks just to keep the combo going. So I got the evade is what I'm guessing. My turn again. Now I have new cards drawn. If your deck is empty. The cards from your tomb will move there. So it basically just recycles my cards. Unless they're out of play. Which I'm guessing this is the out of play. You have to short cards. I was about to say no, I'm supposed to use the attack next, right? 
I keep confusing myself every time. Ow. My shield. So I can actually see what happens at the end of my turn and all the buffs that are on me. Okay, that's actually pretty neat. Oh, and then I get to use one of these. Increase an attack card by... Oh, Jesus Christ. I guess I would finish him. Or I can just stab him twice. Well, three times. I'm gonna for, go for that. Okay. Okay, I get it. So I was right the first time. I'm supposed to match it up with the empty squares, but it was actually confusing the hell out of me at first. Let's start a battle. Okay, so we have relics. Or items. Equipment. Whichever one you want to go for. Alright, Kyle, let's go this way. Okay, so I guess we're on our own now. So I'm gonna block myself. I feel like. Hold on. There's like a weird latency between battle speeds. Can we have. Yeah, very fast. Oh, what the hell? Goodbye, buddy. Oh god, that screech he just let out. So now we get to choose from two, uh, well, three cards. I'm going to take this one. Just because we're going to make a poison build. Wait, does he join my party? Or do I just take stuff from him? Oh, I've captured a monster. Oh. So, he joins, oh, he actually joins our team. Okay, that's neat. I like that. Yeah, we're going to go down here. So I guess if he, if he dies, he's out of our party, right? That's pretty neat. But do they fight on their own, or do I fight with them? Oh, your whole team gets, like, the orbs, too. And I can either shield you or me. Poison. <laughs> okay, so I capture I can capture him. He would be more of a tank. So these orbs up here is what you need to collect to collect more powerful monsters. The real question is, can I actually kick people out of the party? Oh I can. So if they don't match, like, what I want, I can literally just throw them out. Can't throw myself out, thankfully. Destroy the plant, boys.
Okay, now I get it. Your uh, teammates are just there until you actually fill them up, gauge wise. Which makes sense. They don't actually like fight with you and use their own skills or you use their skills. It's basically just going down the line and completing their stuff. So now he gets to use an attack. Yeah, see? That's actually pretty neat. I like that. Yeah, why not? We're actually gonna throw out you. Wait, hold up. Oh, so we can always just throw him out or throw him back in. Okay, that's weird. But also cool. So once you have him in your team, you can just swap them out all you want. Okay, we're gonna end our turn. Can you stop poisoning me? Very rude of you. Yeah, let's get rid of the guy who poisons. I can kill one of my own teammates with that. Wow. That's actually pretty funny. But that does give me time to test that out, though. Fills an empty slot. Okay, that's actually pretty nice. But I kind of want the weaken. I could replace that guy, or I could just... Deny. Okay, so he is out of my slot once he dies. Interesting. Alright, buddy, we're gonna put you back in. Oh no, not tree people. friend so let's go ahead and nah let's use this instead I still don't like that that hits a teammate. Okay, so that's at random. Tried to save you, rat buddy. I tried.
Okay, so I guess that just blows up poison is what I'm guessing. Interesting. To a random monster set. Wow, that really doesn't help us too much. <laughs> Let's kill you. The game is actually pretty neat so far. I like it. Just because it feels like more of an RPG, you know, working with a team type situation. Just gotta pick that team that's better for you and not kill your own team with that, you know. This is <laughs> this uh fog really hates teammates, but it does say random monsters, so you know, <laughs> can't really say too much about that. <laughs> Apparently, I'm not meant to have allies. That's what I'm hearing. So I can go back and forth into different battles. Interesting. Who are you guys attacking? My tree? How dare you? Bunch of forest haters. Uh, <laughs> we learned that acid cloud is not useful with teammates that's for sure like it really hates teammates Thankfully, shields last until the end of the turn every time. I didn't have any more attacks in my hand. So the second one would have made no sense because we would have missed the turn on it. Bye, buddy. That's a whole lot of gold innovation, huh? For each party member dead, I get 20 defense. Oh, wait, hold, hold on. No. Oh. Okay. For zero. Eh. Sight. I'm going to take this one. I think Camouflage would do me a lot better. Deals two random cards. I mean, it sounds interesting. How's that? Hold on. That's a mystery. Okay, so this is the event. Give a ghost card. I was say, can I get them one of my freaking poison clouds? That would be nice. Dude, a lot of things I don't want to give you. Just saying. Oh, there's a shop up here. Oh god, and a whole bunch of more events. What do you have up here? Move defense applied. Hmm. They have defense and taunt. Nah. So we're gonna enhance a card too. So it actually shows me what happens to it. Okay, nice. I was hoping it wasn't one of those games that just increases it and just says, Hey, there you go. <laughs> I 
Okay, so destruction means it tears. It's one of the broken cards. Or becomes one of the broken cards. True damage. Um... Yeah, we're just gonna up this. Enhance unit. Oh. So I can enhance one of their skills, or I can enhance mine. But I don't have any of those red ones to enhance my character. So I could bring other heroes. I just have to unlock them, is what I'm guessing. You can purchase masteries as well. Okay. Shopaholic. <laughs> That's an achievement. What's this? Oh, this is an elite fight. Alright, alright. Let's go, let's go. Okay, first things first. I need to get my stuff up. What are you gonna do? Oh, you poison the whole team. That's not good. So this is a curse card. So I just need to think about my character and not any of them. And I'll casually get their stuff. So you do 20 damage to him. It wouldn't make sense to get deal with the, the next cards. So 15 to all, so I want to guard you next. And all they gave me were the acid clouds that would have killed my teammates. Don't build acid cloud if you're going for a poison build, unless you plan on playing with solo, or unless you have a team of heroes. Because I'm pretty sure that whole thing is explanatory. I'll take a nap. Oh. Oh yeah, we're taking you. Come with us. Oh, there's an artifact in here. We're going to take this one. What is all this? <laughs> when a player's turn... Starts increase all damage for allies by eight. The hero, if the hero are no longer okay, I, I could barely read some of that. Maybe I'm blind. But yeah, if the hero has no more than, you know, fifty percent HP. So you have to be below fifty percent HP for that to kick in. I'm guessing. Man, increase amount. And then there is this. I'm going to take that one. Is there a way I can look at all my artifacts? Yeah, there is. Wait, what? I didn't even choose that. Oh, okay. It shows me the one I chose. That's what it was. Ah, uh, okay. So if I pick that chest, it just shows that chest that I picked. Or it shows the other chest that I didn't pick. This character reminds me of something from, what was that old cartoon, Rudy? Yeah, it just reminds me of that. So can I just go back to the shopkeeper every time? Oh yeah, I can. But you use up an enhance in the card removal every, t every time you come in here. Okay, that's pretty interesting. She holds on to the same stuff too. So you don't have to worry about stuff disappearing or not using something. Oh no, not the ghost card thing again.
Dude, can you take a different card or something? I ha I have to do this. I mean, card removal is nice and all, but jeez. Got to trade out one of my defenses just because I already have, like, multiple uh, evasions. So I should be good. Is this a healing hot spring? Yes, it is. I can heal the whole party. Or I can't. I, uh, I don't want to. Oh, summon a hero. Oh, nice. Okay, so some of these events are pretty interesting. So uh, I just summoned a new hero. Nice. So I can't move that hero to the party. Okay, so the rest of these are monster slots. I can only change the... Okay. You can only have one hero in the party. We're learning! Wow! Alright, boss time. Oh my god, waifu, hello. Aren't you looking real fine? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna do this first. Because I feel like you're about to do some BS. Oh yeah, you are gonna do some BS. Can you not? Don't hurt me. Okay, so everybody lost their shield. I gotta do it. Damn it. And it all just hit my teammates. How ridiculous is this card? <laughs> like I said, don't build that card. It's not worth it. Especially if you want to keep your whole team alive. Like, jeez. That should be good, though. Because now that our team is dead, we're just going to go in with a full build of nothing but poison. Off, okay. <laughs> ah, shields. Nice. Eighty percent shield. Almost dead. Um, hello, my shield. Hell, why? Why would you do such a thing? You bully. The victory is mine. My dead teammates are dead. <laughs> <laughs> like, whoops. <laughs> but the Battle Star is still 5 damage. Okay. Achievement, rookie. Well, yeah, you're definitely right. I just killed my whole party within seconds. <laughs> Enjoy. But yeah, guys, hope you all enjoyed. This has been Destiny or Fate. It's actually a pretty interesting game. I like it.
and it was worth the money. For me, that is, because I like Slate Aspire, but this one's actually pretty interesting because it's kind of like Slate Aspire mixed with a little bit of... Mixed with a little bit of a party system and Pokemon because <laughs> you're capturing other things. But you have to have the points for it too, so yeah. They're for capturing and enhancing. So I would say just go after elite monsters for sure. Just because they probably have a lot better skills in the sense. But with that said, hope you guys enjoyed. This has been pretty fun. And to then, peace out.